surface area of a cone. Now this question is an AA star question. Um, we are given information about a cone at the start of the exam paper, which is this, the volume and the curved surface area of the cone. The total surface area is 220 centimeters squared, but this is just the curved surface area. So we've got to be a little bit careful here. So the cone, the curved surface is the bit that's on top here. So the bit around, that wraps around. So that's pi r l is the curved surface area. We're trying to find l. Now the total surface area would include the base. If it was a solid cone, you have a base, which is pi r squared. And that total is 220. Now if you wrote that equation down, you'd get one method mark straight away. Put the numbers in, we get pi times r, which is 5. So let's actually put the 5 in front of the pi. And l plus pi times r squared. r squared is 25. We'll put 25 pi. Um, we could work out that value, but I'm going to leave it all as it is for now. So we've got 5 pi l. Take away the 25 pi to get 220 minus 25 pi. And I'm going to divide throughout by the 5 pi. So like I said before, that was a method mark to get that far. And then when you get to this point, 220 minus 25 pi over 5 pi. That's another method mark. And then put the values into the calculator. 220 minus 25 pi. You don't have to put a time sign in there. It recognizes that as being 25 pi. And then 5 pi. Press the answer and we get 9.00563 So approximately 9. Now quite a lot of people would have forgotten or not realized to do this plus pi r squared thing here and worked it out for just pi r l and would have got 14.0 and 14.0 uh, ish is going to be a special case mark of 1. So this is a three mark question. Um, if you'd messed it up but did, followed it through and got to the 14 for just uh, when you're not considering the base, you'd have got one mark. So it's always worth finishing it even if you're not quite sure if you got it right.